Well, hey, 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 everybody. How's everybody doing? Um, welcome to our Thursday night Feed a Matrix team. We help you recruit opportunity slash training call. My name is Lynn Hamilton. I'm a business developer and phone coach, and I live in Crown Heights, Brooklyn, New York. I am the co-host of this call. Now, we start this call with an invocation. Uh, it's been coming from Joel Olstein's book, I Declare, 31 Promises to Speak Over Your Life. And today's invocation for uh, this is Thursday, March 13th, goes like this. I declare that I will use my words to bless people. I will speak favor and victory over my friends, my family, and loved ones. I will help call out their seeds of greatness by telling them, I'm proud of you. I love you. You're amazing. You're talented. You're beautiful. You will do great things in life. This is my declaration. And I think that's what we kind of do in our group, we just kind of, we, we celebrate everybody because we just have a really amazing team. For the guests who are on this call, uh, we're going to tell you about a fantastic opportunity called Feeder Matrix. You're going to hear about it. Um, it's going to be presented by the woman who, um, she, she kind of keeps us together. She calls us all her <laughs> little children, <laughs> I think that's the school teacher in her, um, for 45 minutes you're going to hear about this opportunity. I would like for you to have a pen and a couple of sheets of paper because you, you will want to take some notes. Vicki is very um, concise and packs this call with a lot of information. Uh, this call is recorded, so if you do uh, miss something, you don't have to worry about it because you can... Um, uh, uh, listen to the replay, but she's going to talk about how we've been a part of this um, this opportunity for the last four months. It's really made an impact on um, our lives, and um, you're going to want to want to know why you haven't heard uh, about this before. So um, let me give Vicky a proper introduction. Uh, she Two hails from Kalamazoo, Michigan. She's an MLM mentor, a success coach, a master blogger. She's uh, my business partner and friend. And uh, I'm going to introduce you now, Miss Vicki Wooden. Hello, Lynn. Thank you. Thank you for that introduction. And um, thank you for opening the call. And welcome, everyone. Uh, welcome our feeder family, as I call you. Yeah, Lindsay, I call you my babies because I do. I get so excited when I see y'all coming in the group saying that, you know, you're confirming somebody for level seven and, and eight, you know, and I know, wow, cha-ching, that, you know, that money probably just paid a bill for you. I know, you know, sometimes you probably can't sleep because you're getting those payments, and I just feel, you know, I'm just so excited for you. So welcome, um, feeder family and welcome guest. If someone invited you to this call, you know, that person really um, would like to help you uh, change um, your financial circumstance. So um, if what you hear on this call pricks your heart at, at all, get back with that person to get their link and um, um, slap down that dollar seventy five to get started. And I tell you, this is a ride that you will never forget. Again, thank you, everyone, for coming on this call. This call is great for our paid members as well as our guests. And this is a call that our paid members should get on every week and bring guests here. You know, what I'm going to say should never get old. It should, you know, the more you hear it, the more you hear this presentation, the better equipped you will be to share the information with um, with the many people who are asking you questions about what is that feeder matrix, you know, because they're seeing it all over. Um, you know, this will help you also to step into the position of leadership because once you get that first recruit and beyond, you are a leader. You know, I was talking to Delisa um, from California, California, Kalamazoo, um, 
earlier. She um, sent me a chat, and, you know, she called me, and she said, yeah, she's going to be on the call. And she was bringing one, this guy, and I said, oh, okay, is he a guest? He said, no, he's my team member. She's making sure that her team gets on here. Um, as well as invite guests. I know Delisa is a is a guest invite, inviting person. I know her personally. So, you know, that's what we all have to do. We have to reach out and share this with people. And I hope that, you know, that what I share and what Lynn share on this call will pass on the excitement that we have about feeder metrics. See, we're not going to um, do any hype hype. Everything that we're going to share with you is tried and true. And those of you who are members on this call, I heard lots of feeder leaders introduce themselves. Lynn told me I can't say nothing until she introduced me. That's why y'all didn't hear me. I was on the call before her. We was worried about you, by the way, Lynn, Lynn. But anyway, um, I'm hoping that the guests will get back with their um, with the person who invited them to this call and join their team. You see, Feeder Matrix is really showing itself strong um, after four years. This company has been in business for four years, but you know, not a lot of people heard about it until four four months ago. And you know, that's coincidental that that's when. Um, we got started, Lynn Lynn, but the Alexis rating has substantially increased over those past months as um, Tammy Moore brought to our our attention, and that is truly exciting because when people are looking at a business, that's one of the things that they go to. They go to see what the Alexis rating is on the business. So I invite everybody on this call to go check that out. You know, the members on our team, and I heard many of you on this call, as well as teams all over the world, are earning substantial amounts of money for the first time in their online career. I have met many people in my two years online, well, a little less than two years I've been online, who have told me they've been online 10 years, 15 years, 20 years. And... You know, they, they just haven't found that right one yet, and they've invested, you know, thousands in, in startup fees in companies and still did not make money in it. And now here they are in Feeder Matrix, and they are making, they are having $100 days, $200 days, $500 days, $800 days, $900 days, almost $1,000 days. I know probably that's Steve Anderson. He probably having him some $1,000 days. I came close one time. But, you know, we're experiencing something that we have not experienced before, and we're experiencing it with this business that we started for a dollar. Seventy-five. You know, one of my team members who has been in for just a little over a month, Miss Tiffany, reported today on Facebook. You know, she showed her proof. She showed her PayPal that she made, got paid over five hundred dollars in two days. I think it was yesterday, and so it was Tuesday and Wednesday combined. She made or oh, got paid over five hundred dollars. This is. Real. I mean, you go to sleep at night and you wake up in the morning and check your PayPal and boom, it's there. You know, today I woke up to an $80 payment. Then in the afternoon I had another $80 payment and a $10 payment and a $5 payment. That's how they come. This is real. This is so real and so doable. And so on that face of that website, when they say that you can make that 99950 whatever that is, hundred k. It is very doable because in just the four months that I have been in feeder majors, I have been paid almost $12,000. I haven't made that in my online career, period, altogether. But in this company, I have made that. I have been paid that. It's not like somebody held that. It held it and then they're going to, you know, dole it out to me. No, I have been paid that into my PayPal account with feeder matrix position and persistence is key. If you position yourself to get paid and you persist with the advertising and uh, um, just the encouraging your team, you will make the money. Feeder Matrix is changing lives. It is so funny. The people at my bank know my name now. Not only do they know my name, but they know my son's name because both my sons are in Feeder Matrix. How you doing, Vicki? Oh, tell sir I said hi. And it's the bank lady, okay? Why? Because we're going in there and depositing our money. You know, get it out of the PayPal, go put it in the bank, paying off things. 
get it out of PayPal, go put it in the bank, having some fun. Finally, not all of the money that's coming into this house is used to pay bills. And I know that I am not alone. People in theater matrix, people on my team can testify to the fact that they are making money outside of their J-O-B. They're making money in theater matrix that they're using to pay off bills. To, and to buy things that they've been needing and to buy things that they've just been playing on wanting to buy for a long time. And now they ha now they can. So if you're looking for a way to make some money, and this is for the people who are in feeder matrix and for the people who are not in feeder matrix. If you, you're in feeder matrix, stay in it for the long haul. If you're not in feeder matrix, come on in. Because if you're looking for a way to make a little money, or a lot of money, let me tell you, you can do it with this feeder matrix. So let me tell you what the feeder matrix is, okay? Now, that wasn't hype. That was real because I am just excited about the feeder matrix, you know, and about what it's doing for me and my family and for what I'm seeing it's doing for my team. Okay, so feeder matrix is a platform. Um, where, well, I say platform like it's it's a business. It's a business slash platform where members – can purchase digital products, okay? That is what the Feeder Matrix product is. It's it's download. It's, it's software, okay? Digital products is simply software for your computer or your tablet or wherever you want to download it to. If you want to download it, you can purchase it and not even download it. Actually, I haven't downloaded any of it because I did not get in Feeder Matrix for no, for the, um, for the, um, for the products. I saw people, you know, promoting Feeder Matrix. The guy came to me and told me about Feeder Matrix, and he was like, yeah, Vicki, they got this software. I went, I didn't get in there for no software. He said, yeah, Vicki, you can pay $1.75 to get started, and you can turn it into $100K. That's, that got my attention was that money, okay? But you, but in Feeder Matrix, we have to purchase this software from member to member, and then it's our choice if we want to download it, okay? Um we, we don't sell it outside of Feeder Matrix. We sell it inside Feeder Matrix. So when we purchase our upgrades, we're purchasing, we're paying for the resale rights to sell Feeder Matrix member to member. And Feeder Matrix is in the process of updating our software packages, people. I I email them, and I don't know, they email me back, this guy named um, Support. He emails me back, and, you know, and I tell him, you know, what I've you know what i been hearing about the software, and, you know, and he says, you know, that we are working on it, we are working on it. So you guys, come on, um, let's just be patient, hang in there. It ain't stopping your money. So just keep on rolling with it. In the meanwhile... Members of Feeder Matrix can download that software if you want to, but you it, it, and you don't have to, but you can still sell it member to member. Now, most members are in it to make the money, just like me, not for the software, and, you know, it's your choice. Okay, so you may ask me, you may be asking, why do you sell it just member to member? Well, I, I, I like the way it's set up that way because it's sort of like Sam's Club where you have to be a member in order to shop. Well, it's the same way with feeder matrix. You want to shop, you got to come and pay me some money to be able to shop. Don't you want to make the money? That's how that's how you get people to come and pay you the money because they have to come and be a member to be able to shop. Now, our members are in a matrix so that we always know who our customers are. Okay, it's almost like when you have a business, you know, like somebody have a makeup business. Okay. Well, they they have these people who are their clientele, and they have them in their roller decks, okay? And so they call them, you know, and, and see if Susie wants some and Susie may not. They have to call and follow up with the next one. You have a network of people in your matrix who are your customers, okay? Not only are they your customers, they're your business partners, and you can network with them, form a partnership with them, form a game plan with them on how to keep your matrix moving, keep your people in your matrix doing their update, purchasing the, pra the packages, because that's what makes the matrix move. I have a saying that a matrix don't work if a matrix don't move. So this matrix is wonderful because of the way it's set up. The Matrix platform helps keep, helps create like a team spirit, 
okay? A team that could be very successful depending on the degree of shared vision and teamwork. And see, and that's why we do this call. You know, Lynn and I said, we need to do a call. That's why we have our group. We need to have a group. We need to have a team, you know? And that is, is very important to keep the spirit up, to keep the motivation going, to keep the encouragement going, because I, my plan is for us to get the 100Ks fast, okay? So those who are all in work with the plan, okay? If you want to get your 100 k fast, then you work with the plan. If you don't and you want to go slow, slow, slow and solo, you can do that, okay? But your money will trickle in, maybe. So let me tell you how the, the Feeder Matrix platform is, is comprised, okay? Feeder Matrix, you know, it's a matrix, and matrices can have different dimensions, but the Feeder Matrix starts out as a 4 by 4 matrix, a 4 by 4 force matrix, which means that you are at the top of your team structure, and you can have four people directly under you. Okay, so already people by thinking, okay, and then there's going to be 16 up under them and 64 up under them and 256 under them. Well, that looked like a pyramid to me, so that's why people going to say it's a pyramid scheme because it's shaped like a pyramid. Well, it's been, uh, I retired from a pyramid, okay, because I'm a retired school teacher and there was a, a superintendent at the top. There were four assistant superintendents under him. Then there were probably about 12 department heads, probably 16 or so department heads up under those assistant superintendents. And then there were the 30-something principals up under those department heads. And then up under those 30-something principals, there was, you know, the, the hundreds of teachers, okay? So, you know, that's in the shape of a pyramid, too. But the difference. That, okay, so that school system is shaped just like the feeder matrix is shaped, okay? But the difference is, as a teacher in that structure, I could never bring home a paycheck that was equal to the paycheck that, that, that the principals brought home or the department heads brought home or the assistant superintendents brought home or the superintendent brought home. As a teacher, I could never make that money. It was never set up in the compensation plan for the Kalamazoo Public School System for me to be able to make what the principals were making or the department heads or the super the assistant superintendent and sure enough not be a superintendent. But the difference between the school system matrix and the feeder matrix is that everybody in feeder matrix can make the same thing that the person at the top can make. You know why? Because you are at the top of your matrix. Everybody on this call is at the top of their matrix. And you can make the same thing that the person four levels above you in that spot where the superintendent is, you can make the same amount that that person at the top is making. You can exceed that. I have people in my, I have a guy in my downline who had made $10,000 when I was still on $4,000. Okay? And he was beneath me. He was beneath my tears, but he was still in my downline. But he made, he was already at 10000 when I was at four. Okay? So, so don't let people, you know, throw you off your square talking that pyramid talk, okay? Because it is nothing but a structure, and it's no different than the corporate America with the exception that the people at the top don't make the most money. Everybody in feeder matrix can make the same, if not more. It just depends on your worth ethics. Okay, what do you do? Are you, you know, your marketing and how you work with your team, how you follow up with the people who sign up up under you.
Okay. Oh, I didn't get. Ooh, yeah, I got hot. I got. I got excited when I was talking about that, thinking about that that pyramid that I retired from. Boy, cause that, 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 boy, I wonder if I could sue them or something. Anyway, the theater matrix that we are in, we all have the opportunity to get that same 100k and beyond. The playing field is level. And in Feeder Matrix, you are at the top of your matrix. Can y'all tell I calm down now? Y'all don't see me waving my hands and stuff. You know, in your Feeder Matrix, you are at the top of your matrix where everybody can make the same amount depending on how they market. And as a team, and as a team, you promote Feeder Matrix. You know, it's not just one person. You have a team, okay? And so now I'm going to tell you what your team looks like and how you make money, okay? Now, what you want to do is you want to look at some of the videos on compensation, on the compensation plan, because sometimes it's, it's, it's better to see it and hear it at the same time. But I'm going to explain it, you know, and hope every time I do this call, I write these notes out again, and I try to explain this compensation part um, better each time. So hang in there with me, folks. Okay, so you sign up for Feeder Majors, you pay $1.75, so that puts you at the top of your matrix. As I said, everybody here is at the top of a matrix. Even though you have upline, you still, where you are is the top of a matrix, okay? So you are, you are an upline, you are part of an upline, and you are part of a downline, okay? So, so you are at the top of your matrix. So the first four people, directly up under you, create your first tier, okay? Now, those four first four people can come from your recruiting, or they might come from the recruiting of the people above you, especially if you have a team above you who is working consistently. That's why the website says spillover, okay? Because everyone in the major should be working. I do not care about the fact that that website say no sponsoring and no recruiting necessary. I need to write him some more emails and tell him to take that off because if everybody just sat and did no sponsoring and no recruiting, nobody would make any money. Nobody would be coming in. How can that work? Feeder Matrix would be doing all of the recruiting. And I want to tell you, Feeder Matrix does do some recruiting. But if you just wait on their recruits to fall, then you're not going to be making your 100K back, okay? So those first four people are directly up under you, and they create your first tier. It's those four people who will pay you $1.75. Now, they're going to pay you the $1.75 whether you brought them in or not, okay? You might be in my downline. You might be, you might be right up under me, and I um, put somebody up under you. That person is going to pay you the dollar seventy-five if they're directly up under you, if they're one of those four directly up under you, okay? Then each of those four people will have four people directly up under them, and that might be, as I said, by spillover or their own recruiting. But either way, the four that fall up under them becomes their first four, their first tier, and they become your second tier, and so that would be 16 people on your second tier. Those 16 people, even if you brought them in, they do not pay you the $1.75. They pay the person they are directly up under, which is one of those first four people that came up under you, okay? Those people on your second tier do not pay you the $1.75. They pay that to the person that they are directly under. But because those 16 people are now your second tier, they will pay you when they do their level two upgrade, which costs $5, okay? And there's 16 of them on that, on your second tier. There'll be 16 of them eventually, and that's 16 times $5 that you will earn off of that second tier. Now, that second tier of 16 people each need four people directly under them who's going to pay them $1.75. Those um, 16 times 4 will equal 64 people. Those 64 people are your third tier. They pay that 
$1.75 to that person that they fell up under. But they will pay you $10 when they do their level three upgrade. So you can kind of match it up. Level three people will pay you for their level three upgrade, which costs $10, okay? Those 64 people, so that's 64 times $10 that you're going to get from those people who are on that third tier up under you. Those 64 people need four people each up under them. And remember, the whole team is recruiting. It could be somebody on your second tier who recruits somebody that falls down into your fourth tier. Okay, people can fall wherever the first empty spot is. And you cannot move people around. People have asked me, can you move people around? Nope, you can't move nobody around. Even if somebody quits, see, the matrix don't take them out. They will just block that site, and then whatever was supposed to go to them will roll up to their their direct upline, whoever is directly up under up, up over them, okay? So those, 60, um, those 64 people on level 3 need, uh, on your tier 3, need four people up under them, and that would be 256 people total, and those 256 people total will be your fourth tier. Your fourth tier people will pay you $20 when they go to level four. So you got that? Uh, level two pay you $5 when they go, I mean, tier two pay you $5 when they go to level two. Tier three pay you $10 when they go to level three. Tier four pays you $20 when they go to level four, okay? Now, that is the first stage of the compensation plan. This compensation plan is in two stages, okay? The second stage is where the four people who are on your first tier, they're the same four people who are on your fifth tier, okay? And they will pay you $40 when they go to level five. So... Fifth tier, level five, $40. And that's four people, because it's the same four people who are on your first tier. Those four people who are on your first tier are the same ones on your fifth tier, and they're going to pay you $40 when they upgrade to level five. The 16 people who are on your second tier are the same 16 people who are on your sixth tier. And they will pay you $80 when they do their level six upgrade. So you stand to receive 16 times $80 from your tier two people in stage two, okay? Because those tier two people are your, your the same as your tier six people. Then there are 64 people on your third tier. They are the same 64 people who are on your seventh tier. And, and they will pay you $164 for level 7 upgrade package, okay? So that will be 64 times 160 people paying you for that level 7 um, digital upgrade package. Are you doing this math? Can you imagine? There's been some days that I have had more than one $160 payment, and I'm thinking, what is that? What, look at what I'm getting paid in one day while I'm at home running errands or watching TV or washing dishes. My phone goes, ting, 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 ting. And, you know, and I look there, and there's a $160 payment. And then, it, it, and then that's not even um, the most of it. This level eight. You have 256 people on your level four, on your tier four. They are the same 256 people on your eighth tier. And they are going to pay you for the level eight upgrade package, which is $320. So you are going to receive, hold on to your seat, you are going to receive $320 from 256 people as they do their level 8 upgrade package. But I used to think it stopped right there. Now, that's amazing as it is, okay? Because, and remember, you're going to get those payments as your, your customers, your
your downline, your matrix is moving, is doing the upgrades, okay? And so will the people above you because you have to do the upgrades too, and that is the, that's the deal right there. If you don't do the upgrades, you don't get paid, okay? So, but I'm going to tell you something. I'm going to tell you a little bit about that in a minute, but I want to tell you something else. I used to think that the payment stopped at um, tier, with the Tier 4 people who pay you twice. The Tier 4 people pay you the, um, the $20 for, for um, upgrade level 4, and they pay you the $320 for um, level upgrade 8. And I figured only the people that I could see were the ones that were paying me. I thought that was all of my matrix right there. But I learned about two weeks ago that that's not it. Even though you can only see the team, the team members who are on your first, second, third, and fourth tier, you still get paid by ones who are beneath your fourth tier. It can happen, and it probably will happen. Because some people don't do the upgrades. They, some of the wait-and-see people don't do the upgrades. They're like, oh, I'm going to wait and see what happens. Or I'm just going to wait till I get four people on my first tier, and then I'm going to do my upgrades. And then they get one person on that tier that would be like, I'm doing my upgrades. And then that person tell their team members, do your upgrades. And that person tell their team members, do your upgrades. And then those people start doing those upgrades, upgrades, upgrades. And that person who was just waiting and seeing, they start missing payments because the system tells us who to pay. We can't just pick who to pay. The system tells us who to pay. And if you're not in position – the system will tell you to uh, to pay somebody who is um, higher up in the matrix and who has paid for that matrix. So this is what I tell my team. I tell my team, and I tell my prospects this. When they come, people come to me and ask me about the matrix, I say, but this is what we do on my team or, or our team, but I say my team. I say, I tell my team to come in and do your upgrades all the way to level five within seven days and to level eight within your first 30 days to position yourself for the bigger payments. You did not get in this matrix to make $7. So why would you sit on level one waiting to make $7? Because let's face it, you came in or you're coming into the matrix to have some of those $500 days, right? Well, you can have those days if you're in, if you're upgraded, but you cannot have those days if you're sitting on level one, two, three, and four. So in order for you to get paid on these levels or from those levels, you must have done the upgrades and purchased those software packages. But if you choose to, not to do it, no pressure, because Feeder Matrix is not going to kick you out. They're not going to kick you out. As long as you do the, the $1.75 package, Feeder Matrix just let you sit there until you, you know, make that seven dollars and and beyond and as people join your matrix and want to upgrade if you have not done the qualifying upgrades the payment will just skip over you we call those the missed payments on my team we bling out a baseball mitt and we call it catching payments you know we don't you know it's not our desire to catch a payment so we're always constantly every day saying upgrade 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 but you know what if you don't upgrade, we'll make more money off of you because your downline that is upgrading will be paying us instead of you. So when your upline is telling you to upgrade, don't look at it like they just want me to upgrade so they can get my money because that's not the truth. Because if your, if, your, if your upline is not telling you to upgrade, then you need to be suspicious because they're telling somebody to upgrade and they're catching some payments, okay? So I say do your upgrades. ASAP. We had a lady come in um, yesterday, and I think it was yesterday. It was either yesterday or the day before, and she went from level one to level eight within 24 hours. She came in, and we had she came in in the morning, and we had her up. Well, she came in at night, and then the next night we had her level eight upgrade party. Just like that, I've had people come in and go from level zero to level five a lot. And I've had some that come in, this guy came in and went from level zero to seven just within within 24 hours. So don't wait because you never know when you have a big baller coming in up under you. So if you have the money, some people say, well, I want to wait until I get until I make the money and feed a matrix before I do the upgrades. That's your choice. 
that is your choice, but you're making an informed decision if you're on this call. And people, please share with your team, with your prospects and with your team, that if they choose to wait. I had this guy talk to me um, yesterday, as a matter of fact. He, he said he didn't think it was wise. He didn't understand. Well, I'm not going to even use the word that he used to describe people who was doing the upgrades to level five and they didn't have no people to find again because I told him I beg to disagree. Because if you don't do the upgrades, your matrix will stall. Okay, and if you come in and you sit on level one and you're waiting um, to get your four people and then you get, you know, your four people and now you're waiting and so then you do your uh, upgrade to level two and now you're waiting for four of your level of your tier two people to pay you um, five dollars or you pay waiting for two of them to pay you five dollars so that you can go to the next level. What are they waiting? What are they doing just like you? Okay, the speed of the leader is the speed of the gang. Okay, if you want to tell when you want to tell your upline, I mean your downline to to do the upgrades, then you have to do them too, and you need to do them first. You need to be able to tell your downline, I was at level five on my first day, or I was at level five on my second day. Then you set the bar for them. But if you tell them that, uh, well, I came in back in November and I'm still on level two, but I'm going I'm to go to level three tomorrow, then they're looking at that, okay, so you've been on, you know, four months now and, and you're just not on level two? Then you tell them, okay, they can take four months to go to level two. How fast you expect your team to get that, to get to the to 100K with that kind of mentality? So I tell my team, go to level five within seven days, go to level eight within your first 30 days. And things happen. When you get to level five, you position yourself for your first tier people who are going to level five to pay that first big payment to you. If they get to level five before you, you are missing your first $40 payments. And you cannot get them back. No refunds, baby. If I catch your payment, whew, to the bank. Hey, Vicky, hi, you back? You doggone right. I got some missed payments. I need to deposit. Okay? You really do want to do your upgrades. Okay? Um, now, you know, we we work as a team. Our, our team, our group, really work as a team. We And, and so we would constantly be encouraging you to do your to do your upgrades. And so you probably heard me say the word upgrades a hundred times because it's really, really important. Um, but we work as a team not only to encourage you to do your upgrades, but we also work as a team, you know, with, with advertising and recruiting. On the Feeder, Weight, Feeder Matrix website, it talks about spillover and spill under. And what that is is the people who are over, who are in the matrix above you are creating Recruiting, you know, we, we've got our four right up under us, and we didn't stop. Do not stop when you get your four. This is not one of those matrices where all you need is four. No, no. You get four, and you keep on going, and you start building up under your people. Somebody said to me, well, if, if I get four, then I get one more. Where do they go? Did they go under your, on your second tier? But I don't get that dollar seventy-five. No, you're going to get $5 when they do their second upgrade, and you're going to get Eighty dollars when they go to level six. You want to build. You want to build your matrix deep. Build it deep. Don't worry about that dollar seventy-five because everybody that you see in your matrix will pay you eventually. And the deeper they are in your matrix, the more they're going to pay you. So help your team recruit. Build that matrix, okay? Sh um, share your marketing strategies with your team. You know, you, you virtually, you have got to help each other or your matrix will go slow. The best teams work by everyone helping to build that matrix. Now, some teams advertise on Facebook, blogs, videos. Um, some are using fiber gigs, which I really like doing the fiber gigs because they can blast your link out to a million places for five dollars, and that's fiber, f i v e r r gig. Well, it's fiber.com, f i v e r r dot com, and that's and it's five as in everything costs five dollars. Okay, so fiber gigs, um, safe list. This guy. <laughs> Thought I said face lift. He said in the group today. He said, "Vicky, what was I listened to the call and I heard you say something about a face lift." 
<laughs> How can we get that? And so that's safe list, everybody. S is in Sam. A, S is in Frank. E, safe list. L-I-S-T, safe list. Oh, my God, that was so funny. I, I just hollered. Okay, um, traffic exchanges, banner ad sites. I love marketing on the banner ad sites. Um, and you can go to um, YouTube and, and just pick one of these things and go to YouTube and just do watch some videos on how to do them. Ask your upline what tools they're using. Now, this is not a time, this is not a, a time to spam your downline and get them to sign up for all kind of old crazy stuff. You want them spending their money and pay the matrix. So you're not trying to get them to sign up on a whole bunch of stuff. Use your tools to help your team. Okay, I use mine, and I and I post it on Facebook. I just use blah 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 to help my team. Okay, do that, and I'll tell you what that will do for you by posting something like that. Okay, it'll do two things for you. You have a tool, right? So you can post on Facebook, or you can post on any um, platform that you do your advertising. I just use my such and such tool to promote ten of my feeder matrix downlines, affiliate links. The two things that's going to do for you, the one thing it's going to do for you is it'll help you to um, advertise whatever it is that other that your tool is, okay, one thing. But the big thing that it'll do for you is it will brand you as a person who is helping your team, okay? That's what people are going to see. Use your tools. Don't try to spam your team into buying all of your tools. Use your tools to help your team, okay, because you want your team using their money to get these, to do their upgrades so that they can get in the position to make more money, okay? So um, there, you can do on, um, online marketing, offline marketing. Some people are having home meetings. Only thing about a home meeting is you can only sign up one person from your computer, your IP address. But um, this guy told me that he had a home meeting. He had everybody bring their iPhones, and they did as long as they did not tap into the IP address of his house. They didn't use his internet on their iPhone. They were able to sign up for Feeder Matrix, and then you know if they knew how to do um, um, the, um, they could use his computer to go to PayPal and do the whole payment part. Okay, but they could actually do sign up for a feeder matrix, do the registration on their phones as long as they were not using his IP address. And I thought to myself, ingenious. Okay, so some people are having home meetings. Some people are renting out rooms at hotels and doing mass meetings. It's up to you. You know, sky's the limit. That's one thing I like about feeder matrix. They have not said, not to say, hey, 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 you can't do that. They ain't say that about nothing that I've seen. You know, market respectfully, you know, respect people. Don't be posting about your business on other folks' on Facebook page, please. That, that's not good marketing. You don't have to do that. There's, I mean, you know, we are, from, and from what I've been seeing, I've been seeing very respectful um, feeder matrix marketing, with the exception of one thing. When you see somebody else's feeder matrix ad in a group, don't post yours right up under it. You know, don't post your link in their comment section, but you can say something in their comment section like, yes, this um, business is amazing. Yes, this opportunity is amazing. Something like that to help, you know, to help um, them promote. And it doesn't matter if they're on your team or not. Still do that, you know, and, and people will be like, wow, those be the matrix people. Look at them. They got the whole teamwork going thing, you know. Um, uh, so there, so you can do online and offline word of mouth marketing, you know, sky's the limit, you know, rent a, a hot air balloon and put it up there. I don't know, you know, it, drop cards, um, Flyers. I know this lady. I talked with this lady who signed up. She got a flyer in the mail. Didn't know the person who sent it from Adam. And she signed up because it just sounded great. Okay, she went to the website that was on that flyer and she signed up. But then she didn't have, he didn't, like, you know, contact her, contact her, and she tried to contact him, and there was no contacting, you know, she couldn't find him, so then she ended up finding me on YouTube, so whatever you do out there, you know, make sure that you're accessible to your um, to your downline. The main thing is to keep your matrix moving and to advertise and upgrade. So, as I said, on our team, which is amazing, our mission is to go to level five within your first seven days, to go from level zero to level five, cost $76 
and 75 cents. And uh, we're asking our new members to make that investment within their first seven days. Why? Because a matrix don't work if a matrix does not move. Um, think big. Always think big. And if, um, you know, and, and like I said, tell your prospects that. And, you know, if they feel that your expectation is too much, okay, that's okay. There's, there's plenty of matrices out there that, you know, that are different. I don't, you know, don't tell them what I own somewhere else. You know, don't do that. But if they want to make 100K fast, then this is probably the best bet. Um, so we don't, uh, oh, oh, and here's another thing. We don't recruit you and just leave you out there to fend for yourself. As you see, we have this training call, and we also have a training call on Sunday that we do, and we don't talk about feed and matrix. We just talk about tra marketing strategies, okay? So, Lynn, um, I think I'll use up my 45 minutes and maybe part of yours, but um, can you share some of the awesomeness about our team and how we work um, on our team to build and recruit and motivate and all that good stuff. Oh, yeah, sure, Vicki. Um, thank you for how you laid it out. You always do such a great job with that. Um, and Vicki is correct about the awesomeness of uh, this team. You know, we may be a little bit biased because we created it, but um, we did so because we left another, we were in another Athena Matrix group. And uh, we didn't like the way it smelled over there. And so, you know, I said to Vicki, we, we're going to have to leave here and and create a group. And she didn't want to do it. She was like, mm-mm, I'm no, no, not going to happen. I said, Vicki, we got to do it. And so we created this group. But we didn't do it by ourselves. We brought some folks with us who um, who, who saw what um, they could do with Feed a Matrix and uh, they became our admin. Uh, there was, there was, I guess, about six or seven of us when we started. But Reggie Worthy of Indianapolis, Indiana, is one of them. He um, co-admins the group with Vicky and I, our main group. We we do have two groups, and then we have another. The other group is our look see group. That's the group that you can bring your prospects to. Uh, we call it a call it a staging area for bringing your prospects. Uh, into a group that is welcoming, and they too can find information. We have a, a file section in both um, groups, and so I'll tell you about that in a moment. But they could get information about what feeder matrix is all about without any, but without feeling that somebody's going to come and um, uh, pitch them anything else. This is just a way to, you know, uh, find out about this group, and as soon as you're ready to make the move. The person who brought you in will uh, give you a link. So the two the two people who are responsible for that group, the welcoming committee, um, uh, you could say, um, is uh, Melody Richards from Belgrade, Minnesota, and Rosina Miller of Washington, D.C. And then we have just a bunch of um, amazing people who just, I mean, Vicki and I and, and Reggie, we can't be in the group. 24 hours. And so there are just folks who come in and they just help folks out. And I'm not going to name any names because it's, it's too many of you all. Like I said, it's now, our group is now over 2,500 people. Um, and it, that just still blows my mind. Um, I used to know most of these folks and, and, and now I don't, but I'm getting to know them again as we, we do these um, amazing promotions that that keep the group moving. It's the momentum. You got to have the momentum. As Vicky was saying, uh, uh, if if a matrix doesn't move, it doesn't work. You come in and and sit there on that level, uh, one tier. Um, I had to. I laughed when you said it, Vicky. Um, uh, and getting seven dollars. You didn't come into this for seven dollars. You came in here because someone told you that you could make 100K. Um, and if you're sitting on level one, you are uh, really making a mistake. So what we do, we have promotions. Now, we try to do them every two to three weeks. We have a team rotator that when you, prom when you um, upgrade, you know, Vicki explained the seven levels. So for each upgrade, when we have a promotional uh, period, and it usually lasts 12 hours, 
It starts at 6 a.m. in the morning and goes until 12 midnight. You can rem um, upgrade multiple times during that period, and each time you upgrade, your link gets put in a rotator that is marketed all over the Internet. That rotator could be on, like Vicki talked about, her, her banner sites, on Craigslist, on a fiber gig, um, on Facebook. It could be anywhere. So um, we do that not for you to say, well, okay, they're marketing my, my link. I could just chill. No. We do that to give you some added marketing muscle so that you continue to promote your link and then if you're in the rotator, you get, um, you know, some extra help from us. And uh, maybe someone is going to, you know, click on the link and you're going to be the person up. And then that, that prospect will sign up with you. That's how the rotator, that's how the rotator works. The other thing we do, um, uh, we've implemented a cash prize drawing. And what happens with that, anybody who upgrades to levels five, six, seven, or eight, they get entered into a drawing and they, you know, it could be $25, $50, but here's the thing. You can use that money to upgrade yourself. You can use that money to upgrade a um, team member, help them upgrade, or you can take some of that money and bring in, you know, uh, play it forward to play it or pay it. I always forget which, which way you say it. Um, pay it forward to someone who may not have a dollar seventy-five at the time, and you can bring them in for that. So, you know, there, there's a lot of people you can bring in for $25 or, or $50, or you can do whatever you want. Maybe You may buy a couple of fiber gigs, whatever. But what it is that we, we, we make that available for you so that you can keep moving in your group. Okay, so we had a uh, promotion yesterday. It was the Camel Walk promotion. And I'm telling you, it was the largest promotion we have had to date. Um, it was double the size of the last promotion we had three weeks ago. And um, there were a number of people who um, upgraded to eight, who went to the top. And, and I know two of them were, were on this call. And so what happens when you get to eight? Well, two things. We first throw you an extraordinary party, okay? And you would think that you were at, I don't know, in New York City at the time it was, it's, um, um, the garage, the paradise garage. I'm probably dating myself, but um, there's music. There's it's all virtual, of course, but music. There's drink. There's food, and it's fun because here's the thing: why can't you have fun while you're making money, right? So that's what happens when you get to eight. You uh you have this wonderful party, and even as you're upgrading, as you're getting to eight. We're celebrating you. Um, you know, we, we're just telling you, you know, just keep going, and we're giving you tips. Inside this um, uh, Facebook group is also a vast resource of videos, how-tos, scripts to really grow your business. So there is no reason why you can't succeed every day. Vicki puts out a, a mini to-do list, and on that list, it's telling you some of the things you can do to get your business moving, okay? I don't know a lot of groups that do that. I mean, she spends a lot of time every day putting together the, the, the right graphic that's going to convey what you should be doing today, okay? It's really step-by-step plug and play. And if you can't do that, then maybe this is not the type of business you should be in. But it's really simple enough that anybody could do it. What else do we do in this group? We have mindset. 
um, you know, my feeling is that you cannot get to the next level until you got your mind together. You know, if you think that you can't do something, you cannot do it. Uh, we talk about not having any stinking thinking here. We introduced the group to thought leaders like Jim Rohn and Earl Nightingale, Les Brown, John Maxwell, Catherine Ponda, Willie Jolly, a bunch of people who tell us that when you change your thinking, you change your bank account, okay? Um, what else do we have in this group? Um, the many to do this. Uh, listen, we want to work with the willing. There are a bunch of people who come into feeder and, and they just sit there. Um, you already heard about the missed payments, but when, when someone comes into my group and they start, you know, doing the list, uh, going into, into Facebook groups and marketing groups and uh, posting their links, interacting with people, that's how you do a business. That's how you do a business. So let me tell you now about what happens because this all culminates, culminates on getting to eight. When hey, you get, excuse me, can, can I, excuse me, yes, I got my hand up, Lynn. Lynn, can you tell them about the escorting their, their members into that group? Okay, all right, all right. Okay, let me do about eight first. When you get to level eight, your matrix implodes. Vicky likes to say it morphs. So on, on your first level, um, you're, when you first start Feed a Matrix, you only have four um, legs. When you get to eight, the company opens that up, and you can have as many as, well, we know Reggie Worthy has something like 12 or 13 legs. So that's three times the four that you originally have. So to me, that means I no, no longer have the ability to make just 100K, I can make 300K. Um, so that's amazing. Now, escorting your people in a group. Both of our groups are secret groups, so you must um, be escorted in those groups. You, No one can just give you a link and tell you, okay, come into our group. So when you um, sign up someone, you must bring them into the group, you must add them to the group, and then you must welcome them and tell them that, uh, you know, to watch the top post because there's information there and to go through our file sections. And that takes place in both of our groups. Um, now, I just want to add this one little thing, and then I'm, I'm kind of, I guess I'm kind of finished what I have to say. I want to talk about what's going to happen tonight. Once the guests sign up tonight, okay, when you sign up, we don't want you to use any cutesy username. No names like Diva Making Money, Cool Mo D Daddy. Um, use your name. Your name is Sam Cook. Use Sam Cook. This is how you should do it, though. Make it all lowercase letters, no spaces. Okay? No spaces, dashes, underscores, periods, commas, apostrophes. None of that, because when you do that, you can mess up your link, and it can wind up going to someone else. I know, I know at least three people who that has happened to. The other thing is, you are doing this kind of business to brand yourself, so people won't know who Diva Making Money is, but they will know who Sam Brown is. They will know who Audrey uh, Cohen is. Okay, they know your name. And and here here's the other thing. When um it's time to confirm somebody or to um receive payment, you want to find people and when you know what their names are, um, it just helps you. One last thing. You could get started tonight, even you know, you need two payment processes 
to start Feed the Matrix. Really, you need one to start, but they want you to have two. We are an international company. So in the United States, PayPal and Solid Trust Pay is available to us. Internationally, there are three others, PESA, uh, Perfect Money, and Perfect Money, and what was the, what's the other one, Vicki? Eagle Pay. And Eagle Pay. Those are the three that are available for the international team. But you can leave this call today if you don't have a PayPal account, okay? You can create the account. You can go to CBS, Rite Aid, Walmart, Walgreens, and purchase a, a loadable prepaid, um, not a prepaid, a loadable PayPal card, and on that card, you can add any amount from $20 to $500. Now, I'm not telling you all to go out and put $500, unless you want to go straight to eight, and then you could do that, but we're just looking for you guys to get started with level five. Go to level five in your first seven days. Go to one of those stores, pick up one of those uh, loadable cards, put a hundred dollars on it, you know, and then sign up tonight. So that's what I had to say, Vicky. I'm I'm turning back over to you. If you wanted to add anything else to that, yep. I just want to add just a little bit. Um, I still got five pages of notes, but that's gonna uh, I I'll share most of this next week because next Thursday is just training. The third Thursday of the month is just training. You know, no guests, but if the guests come on, that's fine, but it's it's all training. Um, but I just want to hit one more point. When you get someone who signs up on you, when, and where you find that is at, on view referrals, you're going to get a, a message from um, Feed a Matrix, but you can always go back in your back office and, and click that link that view referrals link and you will see people and you will see your matrix. You'll see some people in the upgrade column, they'll have a zero. That means they haven't paid yet. Look at their email address. Some people are having trouble um, with the whole registration process because they're not using Gmail. They need to have a Gmail. I don't know if you said that, Lynn, but they need to have to use Gmail when they're signing up. If they're using AOL or Hotmail or, or Yahoo, they're going to have problems. Now, those people in your matrix right now who have Hotmail, Yahoo, AOL, please talk to them and tell them to um, get a Gmail and change it in their profile because some of them are going in and trying to log in and they can't and it's because Peter Matrix is blocking their site because they told us months ago they want us to have a Gmail. And I think it's if you look at that the um, profile page, like click on to update your profile, you'll see where it says it, that they want us to have Gmail. So please, please, please get your people to have have Gmail. When you're talking to your prospects, tell them to use the Gmail. It does not matter what your PayPal email address is. If your PayPal email address is something, something, Yahoo, that's fine because that um, email address is going to go in your payment setting. So it doesn't matter what's in your payment settings, but what you have in your profile, what you sign up for with on that reg registration is going to make, make a big difference. There are some people who um, um, who are trying to sign up and they cannot get signed up and it's because of that of especially Yahoo it's because of that um, what's the other thing I'm going to say I think that's it that that is just a big thing because I've been getting lots of inboxes where people are having trouble and it's because of those email addresses and it's also because of what Lynn said those fancy usernames that they're making up with the appersons and all of that and then when they go back to try to log in it's not working or they are recruiting they are advertising 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 and they're wondering why they're not getting any signups this one girl came to me and she said I've been getting I've been advertising for two 
two weeks, and I've been posted in all these groups, and I haven't gotten out one sign-up. Then today, I was so happy. I gave my link to my girlfriend, and she signed up, and she paid, but it wasn't me, and I don't see her in my back office. So, you know, I asked the questions, asked the questions back and forth, you know, in between her. I'm disgusted. I have to tell, please stop saying you're disgusted. Listen, tell me what the facts are so that we can work with it. I told her finance, say, show me your link. She put her link in my chat box, and I could see right there. Her, her, it was um, HTTP, and then www.feedermatrix.com, you know, backslash, um, um, equal sign, um, question mark, blah, blah, blah. But then her username was Jolly Space D, and the D was not highlight, highlighted. Everything else on that link was highlighted except that D. And so I asked her, I said, is this your link that you give to people? I said, copy and paste it to me. And she said, I did. So I clicked on that link, and it took me to somebody's website, and in the inviter spot, it said Jolly. So this girl been recruiting for Jolly and <laughs> not right. Jolly and not Jolly Space D. Yes, and, and, and it's so, you know, it's really sad when that happens, you know. It's very sad. Yesterday, you know, people send me their links to get into the rotator, and I just have a keen eye about that. There were three people who came to me who had that very same problem. Part of the the link was hyperlinked, and then there was there was a space and the other name. And I mm -hmm. said, you know what, you really need to take care of this. I said, I don't even want to put this person in the rotator because, you, can. you know what, it's going to go to somebody else. I think the person, it was like Rocky J or Rocky Jones, no, Rocky something, whatever. And Rocky was on the end, but then there was a space and then the rest of his name. Mm -hmm. And I said, that's just going to go to Rocky. That's not going to go to Rocky Jones. Right, yeah, don't put no. those in the rotator because they, they, that's not even no, going to benefit know. that person's team. No, no. I saw so someone I had their know. username was an email address. Yeah. And those people, and then, so, and, and <laughs> the weird part about it is some of them are even upgrading. And they, they, don't, they don't have anybody under them because can't nobody get up under them with those um, usernames. So please, I, I tell my prospects all the time, nothing fancy, just use your name. Use your name and your last initial, or use your first initial and your last name. But, you know, it is imperative that, you know, you have Gmail and a username that has no spaces and no fancy signs. Okay. Then I so, think that, oh, oh, one last thing. I'm sorry, Lynn. The thing that I was going to tell them is to reach out to your downline. Anybody who's in your matrix is part of your team. You can talk to any of them. You have their email addresses. You want to help them. You want to find out how they're doing. You want to find out if they need some help. You want to build up under them, help build up under them. In the group, we have letters. We have letters for the people who are on level zero. I say turn your zeros into heroes. We have letters to find, you know, that you can send to them. Find out why they're still on zero and how you can help them. Uh, we have a letter for your level one people. You need to connect with them to get them into the Facebook group. You can't get them into the group if they're not your fa your Facebook friend. So there's a process there. You need to connect with them and tell them, hey, we need to become friends on Facebook so I can add you to this fantastic book group because there's lots of resources there. You want them in that group. They need to be a part of the excitement in that group. Okay. And we're going to be talking about more on that because that's really training, and that's what we're going to be talking about next week on the call. Yes. Mm -hmm. but I wanted to make sure that we got that out, Lynn, because uh, we got a bunch of new people on this call. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. And these people are ready to make some money because they're going they up to level eight, I'm Paula. They are moving <laughs> very quickly. So, yes. you know, folks, this – this call is recorded. I'm going to give you the uh, the number that you can uh, listen to the call again, the replay number. It's 424-203-8409. The code is the same, 74488-pound sign. And then you will have to hit the pound sign again when it asks you for the reference number. So that's 424-203-8409. The code is... 
pound sign and then hit the pound sign again. Um, we want you guys to come every week to this call, and, and it's really important that, you know, you bring your team, but you bring your guests because you want your business to grow. And that's how it happens when other people know about what you're doing. So I'm going to end this call with a quote from Anthony Robbins. Your decisions, not your conditions, determine your financial destiny. So mm. you guys chew on that. Vicki, mm -hmm. I'm going to say good night to you. Okay, good night, Lynn Lynn. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody else. We'll see you here again next week. All righty. Good call, Lynn Lynn. Good call, Vic.